hello and welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new today i'm going to be going over my second paycheck for the month of december and i'm using my b5 docker notebook that i got from amazon for like eight dollars and i'm using some budgeting stickers from romina rosa so let's start with my income. I should be getting my paycheck on December 11th. And I'm expecting to bring home about $1,900. And I do have a few more bills due with this paycheck. So my first one is my housing for my assignment. And I kind of pay like after the week is over, so it's kind of like behind a week. So I am still paying for this with this paycheck. <laughs> and I'm budgeting $625. And then I have my common bond student loan. And that actually comes out on the 19th. And that is $200. Then I have my Bank of America 1 and 2. And those will be 170 together. I don't know why I have them combined, but I do. <laughs> my Disney Plus is going to be $7 and I'm trying to get that change where I can just pay it once a year but I haven't done that yet my Netflix is going to be $14 and let me put the due dates in for Bank of America is the 11th and the 15th Disney Plus is due on the 13th and Netflix is due on the 14th and then I have my HP Inc which is due on the 18th and that's still eight dollars I want to go in and cancel one of my printers but I haven't actually done that yet so it's still gonna be eight dollars so then we're going to move down to other expenses. So groceries should be about $120. And then gas, we'll probably just do $30 because I don't really expect to be driving a whole lot in December because by this point we will have already gone back home and that's going to be our main gas expense for the month until we go wherever we're going next. <laughs> so I think $30 should be plenty for gas and then I have personal which is $50 and then my sinking funds which we're going to just do another 200 so I did 200 with my first paycheck and then 200 with my second paycheck that way with my third paycheck I'll only have to do 160 to fund all of my sinking funds so I'm gonna go ahead and add all this up adds up to $1,424 and then whatever's remaining I'm going to move to my savings so we're going to subtract $1,424 and 
that leaves us with $476. So that amount will get moved to my savings account and just stay there unless I need it. And in which case, if I don't need it, it will go towards my debt in January. So this is my second paycheck breakdown for the month of December. If you enjoyed this video, please hit the like button as well as subscribe to my channel if you're not already subscribed. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.